morning, I'm Lindsay Hunkler, and today on Midwest Outdoors, we're fishing Vilas County with John Andrew, the Angler's Choice Guide Service. John, what are we gonna be fishing for today? We're gonna be jigging for walleyes today. Now, the water temperature is cold. It's only about 47 degrees. The walleyes are moving slowly. We've gotta present our baits to them nice and slow. We'll also be using a stinger hook. It's very important. We'll be catching all sizes of fish. Little ones, medium ones, it'll be a lot of fun. It'll be exciting. Let's get started. All right, sounds good. Good job, Linz. Got it. That's it, Linz. That's your nice Yay. first first walleye on that. Oh, look, Linz. Oh, the, that's nice. On the stinger hook, just like we talked about. A lot of people say, well, if they're biting, why do we need a stinger hook? Right. And the important thing is to understand when the water's this cold and they're biting, we want to make sure we catch the fish. Good job, Linz. Thanks. This is our the jig we're using, the pink jig and the minnow. You see how lively he is? Mm -hmm. This particular stinger hook clips into the eyelet. The stinger hook hangs down. It's about a one inch stinger hook. It's a very small treble hook and we poke it in to the minnow behind the dorsal fin. And we put it on an up angle. So when the fish bites it, he's got the hook right away. Okay. Even a big walleye may not grab the whole thing. He may just grab the end of it. We have to present the bait right in front of the fish's nose. They're not gonna swim eight, 10 feet away to go bite it. So that's why we're not reeling it in slowly. For Correct. Them to follow, it's what, gotta be. We're gonna keep the bait down there all the time. Okay. And I'm gonna move the boat with the electric trolling motor all day. Okay. So your hook will move around, but it'll be the boat moving your hook. Nice. Yeah, another little walleye. But again, the same thing. Look how they get on the stinger hook. And it's really important to understand, and especially for the viewers, even if you're getting bigger walleyes and the water's this cold, we're at about 46, 47 degrees, a stinger hook is important. So John, we've had a great morning out here. What do you have planned for us this afternoon? What we're gonna do now is we've caught several walleyes. They're a little smaller, so I wanna go to a different lake. We're gonna use maybe the same color jig head. We'll see when I get over there. But this time of the year, we wanna stick with the sh sharp ledges, the drop-offs, the main lake basins. Uh, some lakes we could be fishing in 65, 70 feet on the bottom. Some lakes only 35 feet, like this lake. So let's get packed up and we'll head right over there. All right, sounds good, let's go. over to that other lake we talked about. Let's see what we got going here, Linz. Look at the bend in that. Oh, it's here really it comes. exciting. Oh, it's a nice one, Linz. Boy, look, nice. at, look, Linz, right on the stinger hook. Folks, I want to show you something exciting. Look and see what this walleye went through. You know, when I set the hook, we had the walleye on. All of a sudden, the pole got it, the rod, and the, the hook got extremely heavy, and we know, and I, the drag started going out, and right away we knew it was a bigger fish, but I think a muskie grabbed him on the way up. So John, you guide year round, right? Uh, that's correct, Lindsay. I, I'm guiding from the beginning of May to Thanksgiving, a little bit after Thanksgiving, depending on the year. Uh, you know, about 180 days in the boat guiding. What do you do during the winter? In the winter, I've got several wood insulated and heated ice houses. Uh, they're nice, they're paneling, carpeted. Uh, I guide, last year I guided 65 days ice fishing guiding. Uh, wow. Eight or nine days snowmobile trail guiding and about 12 days hunting guiding. I guide Vilas County, Iron County, uh, and uh, Oneida County, Wisconsin. You know, it's really a lot of fun for me, helping a lot of people. On average, about 400 guests a year I have in my boat. The, the seasons fill up early. Uh, I encourage people to, whoops, I encourage people to 
uh, give me a call if they'd like to get together. There, I got them that. Oh, there. nice. Yep, actually, that one might be a nice one there. Well, you know, we've got a good year class running of these size fish here that, we've, uh, that we're going to pull up right here, right now. This is a good spot. Yep, that's a good one. That's a nice one, Lynn. It's been a great day fishing with you, John. Again, how can people get a hold of you if they want to book a trip? You know, Lindsay, uh, thank you very much. And a simple, right to my website, theanglerschoiceguideservice.com, and that'll take you right into the website. And of course, the rest of my information is on there also. Well, perfect. Thanks again for having us out here. Yep, you're welcome. And it's always a pleasure to work with Midwest Outdoors. Thank you.